Lucas Media. So we got news coming out of the boxing world. Shout out to Blue Blood 78. Jerron Boots Ennis is signing with Matram and Eddie Hearn. Eddie Hearn, who partnered up with his own several years ago, and everybody was making fun of the zone. Now was trying to snatch fighters up right and left. Like 78 said, he's partnered up with the billionaires in Saudi Arabia. And we all know that people in Saudi Arabia have no problem paying for the fights. And you're going to get them for a good price. Like Francis Ngangu and Anthony Joshua. They had a video game and the fight was $40. And I believe Devin Haney last fight was maybe $40. I can't remember, but Eddie Hearn is out here making moves. And the zone is not going anywhere. They're not going nowhere. Riyadh, Saudi Arabia is not going nowhere. And you're starting to see fighters slowly and slowly creep over to the other side of the street. I don't blame them, honestly. Because you got people who, like a Leo Santa Cruz or a, a Gary Russell Jr. who hasn't fought in years. Even Danny Garcia. Devin, Danny Garcia did an interview last week. At the Fondora Tim to Zoo fight, and he said that you know he just he built an empire, but it, it, he ain't boxing not because of him, but because his name ain't getting called. And we get it. Showtime switch from or Showtime PBC switch from M from Showtime to Amazon, but there's no dates. Word on the street is all the money comes from the back end. There's no guaranteed money, and according to Michael Benson. The numbers did the last this pay per view they did was under fifty thousand, so they're not going to fight like that. And even the Tank Davis who hasn't fought, it's coming up on a year since his last fight. And before, and like he he's been very inactive. A lot of these PBC fighters, Keith Thurman ain't fought in years, and he keep claiming injuries. But anyway, I digress. But this is why people are going to to match them because you can get the fights, you can get the dates, and you're gonna get paid. You're going to get paid. I thought John, Jerron Boots Ennis had an exclusive deal with the with Steven Espinoza, but clearly he got out of that contract. And I, I really don't care where these fighters fight on what network because I ain't got no loyalty to none of these networks. So they, all, they always take my money and my time and they be playing games. But I do want to see Boots more active. And Eddie Hearn, he can build him up and, you know, get him over, get fights over in England and, all of that to make him more of a star. Now, uh, according to Blue Blue Blood Sports, Boots Ennis and Connor Ben is in negotiations for a fight. I'm I'm willing to see that, and I'm willing to pay for that. You know, because Boots, we haven't seen Boots really fight somebody who was a threat, and I do see him beating Connor Ben, but I do see him that being a good fight, and I could also see that fight being in. At Wembley or was it the O2 Arena? So I can see that fight being over there in England. But I'm glad for Boots. And I'm glad for other fighters who are. I, I, and like I said, it don't matter if you're a PBC or whatever. I just want to see. I'm glad that fighters are getting able to fight. Get money in their pocket. And we get to see them on TV. You know, why are we only seeing Leo Santa Cruz once every three years? Gary Russell once every three years. Why? why? And I can name Danny Garcia. As these three fires, as, as I said earlier, and these are just that's just a small bit. I could Google P PBC fighters right now and ramble off name after name who hasn't been active. What happened to um? What happened to Jared Hurt? What happened to him? You know, Charlos. They don't fight that out. Well, one of them had a mental, you know, had personal issues, but Charlos don't fight that much like that. And I remember PBC was just the hottest thing, and everybody was loyal to them, but then, just like boxing, them fighters get screwed over, and so do us fans get screwed over. But I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. Shout out to Boots. I will. Hopefully, this fight will go down between him and Conor Ben, because I will pay for that. Tell me what y'all think.